Hey, this is the DIY Magician, and we're back with another How to Create an Upcycle Puppet, or How to Make a Cow Puppet the Hard Way. Here he is. He is a Critter's Christmas Songbook Singing Cow, what you have it, uh, let's get my glasses on so I can read and see what he is. He is a cow from uh, TL Toys. HK Limited, and it was made in Hong Kong apparently, and look what it does. Watch this. You ready? Here he goes. Merry Christmas, I hope he said. Mooey Christmas. Oh, I get it. Let's hear it again. I, I think he's done. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's do this. Let's make a little cow, a uh, mooey cow uh, Christmas uh, puppet. Uh, and I'm going to remove all the accoutrements here. Uh, this little guy is... He's sewn on there, I believe. Yep. So we can get rid of him. We'll get rid of him in a second. But let's do this. Let's get the actual cow removed. Stop. Stop. Uh, remove from his uh, surrounding deal here. I think this one's all glued on, which it looks to be that it is glued on. Let's get a little tool in here to help me along. Oop. Maybe I shouldn't use a seam ripper. Maybe I should use a screwdriver. There we go. Not that they cost any different. I don't think seam rippers are that expensive, but I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to have to go out and replace it right away. I think I can. I can part with a screwdriver here. This is the Dollar Tree special screwdriver set. Okay. So let's see. Whoop! Stay there. Oh, stop! Stop! Is this got? Oh, there it is. Okay. So it's just glued on. It's just a matter of getting a good grip of it and peeling the glue off. Okay, hang on. It's like taking an inner tube off a, or a tire off a rim, like a bicycle, on this particular one. So this is going to be a, I would imagine, a glove type puppet because it is very small. I believe my hand will fit, so we're going to find out in a few moments but boy I'll tell you this glue is on there pretty darn good okay all right there it's coming though just takes a little bit of effort so I think I'm about uh, well ah come on about halfway done I think there we go okay once I get a good grip of it here I think it should come a little easier get my finger into there maybe not maybe I still need to I think we're still gonna use the screwdriver okay now you know yep is that it there it is okay Stop! Keep wants to move. To move it, move it. To move it. Okay, I think this is it. Oh boy, I bent that thing. Hang on, let me use a, use a little stronger screwdriver here. Let's see here. There it is. Done! Move! Sorry. So there he is. The movement has happened. And oh, good. There's a little buckle. I love these buckles. Except when they're glued shut. That's not so fun. They put a buckle on it, but then they give you a, like a little shot of hot glue. 
Okay, so let's get this little guy out of here. Let's move him on out. Okay, oh, okay, a couple stitches. Oh, you know, by the way, if you guys ever run across these things and you make your own, I, I'd love to see some pictures or tell me about a video or something like that. I think that would be fun. Okay, now, while I have him, I will try and find out where, oh, the, it's on the foot. Oh, that's so easy. Because if we're going to use this guy again, we need to have the button. Might as well, right? Oh, and it's just stitched on. That's even better. Okay. To move him out of here. Huh. A moo. Uh, 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 come on. Sometimes it, it, it seems like it's going to be easy, but it's not. Hold on. All right. Several stitches. There's even one more. Here we go. And one wrapped around the cord. Wow. Okay, so let's put this bad boy back together. Okay, you ready? Here we go. He's loud. Move. Mooey Christmas. Christmas. Ha! Huh. Okay, he goes over here. And now the oh and I, oh I wanted to take some of these things off. Hold on a second. Let's do this. Let's get our seam ripper. I might have to resort to skizzers. I uh, I have to call them skizzers because I can't say scissors. Thank you, Barry. Barry Mitchell. Alright. All right, so hold on. There he is. Okay, so there's the songbook. Let's get rid of him. Uh, let's see. It looks like a sweater. Let's get the sweater off. Okay. Kind of looks like a gerbil, but that's okay. And then let's get in here and pop some of these stitches here. It, wow, that came right off. It was that one stitch. Hold on. Sometimes they loop it all the way through, and I don't know how we're going to do this. Hold on. Maybe it's attached to this one? No? It's silly how they make these things sometimes. If you get a chance... Take a part of stuffed animal or one of these little guys. It's fun. It actually is fun. There's all sorts of things that you'll learn about. Let's see here. Hold on. Right there. Okay. And of course that little, uh, there it goes. This little guy came off. Now you can use these things for something else. In fact, this would be great. Um... Is that cardboard? What is that? I don't know. Hot glue. Boom. Right there. Two eyes. That would be cool. So I'm going to save these for another project. Uh, this could be a belt or something or a tie. Save that. Uh, who knows what we could do with this. Just a jacket on some other animal. Put that down there. Let's put these away. And whoop, right like that. I get to sweep up the garage later. Or studio. This one, however, is going to be tricky because I've got a big hand. And that's a little opening. But I'm, I'm doing it. Slowly but surely. I'll tell you what. That's about as good as it's going to get right now. Uh, the arms are there, so some of, some of you could can do it yourself. Uh, if I really wanted to, uh, immediately I could rip this a little bit more, but I want to try and 
and save this. But here it is. And of course, the mouth um, will move. <laughs> It'll move. Uh, it's, and then, of course, the uh, little arms like that. Okay. There is a little glove puppet just like that. Uh, I don't even know how much I paid for him. Probably not that much. But there he is. I think he was 99 cents or 50 cents or something like that. But I made a puppet out of him. Now, thank you guys for coming along on the journey. Uh, if you have been with us before, thank you. If you're new to the channel, please feel free to uh, subscribe for updates. And of course, thank you for coming along. This is the DIY Magician. Till next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.